Hey, what's up guys? I hope everything is going well and that you are fit and healthy as always. Today's video is going to be a really interesting one. I think you'd like it. So please watch it from the beginning to the end to get the most value. Now, the topic of this video is can you lose weight while drinking alcohol? That is a big one. I've literally had that question so many times. Uh, basically, at least 70% of my clients always ask me, okay, Rache, you know, they get the plan, they get the 90 days, they're ready to start next week, and then that question comes through. Rache, can I have something to drink on the weekends when we're having a braai or when we're going out with friends or if I want to take my girlfriend or boyfriend or husband or wife on a date, can I have alcohol? Would that stop me from losing weight? Now, I can give you the long answer, which I will give you, and then I can give you a short answer. And the short answer, obviously, is yes and no. <laughs> and you didn't expect that. You were going to think I'm going to say, no, you can't just, you can't have alcohol. You can, um, but you can also not. And everything is obviously to do with moderation. So you have to have alcohol in moderation. Now, there's different different alcohol that you obviously want to have um, obviously your high content like brandy is full of sugar you know wine also has so much sugar it's really high in calories alcohol is full of calories so if you want to then um, you could have small amounts of like low calorie beers or maybe spirits without mixes which is quite hard like shots of tequila or vodka or whiskey with ice you know those type of things or whiskey with water so those are, you know, that's basically the short answer. Yes, you can, but it's not really that good because it's high in calories. So it's a, it's a yes, no, all right? But let me explain in a longer, more detailed answer why I think, um, and in this scenario, the answer is actually no. Obviously, this is my opinion. Uh, everyone has their own opinion. This is mine. This is me telling you why I think drinking alcohol is actually not good for weight loss. Um, number one, it's super high in calories. It's it's really high of empty, empty calories. So these these calories, and just think to yourself, if you go, if you if you just had to drink a glass of Coca Cola, right? I mean, you'd drink one glass of Coca Cola maybe while you're watching TV or working, and and that's it. But when you go out and you party and you have glasses of coca-cola three four five six seven glasses of coca-cola with brandy in them i mean that's that's incredible amount of sugar that not only that you have in the brandy but that you put in that mix as well so there's there's literally no way that you can you know dodge that bullet in the sense of am i taking enough calories in you are taking way too much calories okay way too much sugar, way too much empty calories, and everything will be right here in your mid six. So that's, that's the first one. Calories, way too high, all right? The second one that I feel is really, really important, obviously, is the amount, okay? So what we do in South Africa, I'm not sure about the other countries, but I know for a fact South Africans love their brides, they love partying, they love going out and being social, and that's great. Everyone should do that. Of course, it's, it's fine, but it should be in moderation, especially if you want to lose weight. Listen to me when I say this, obviously, this video is made for someone that wants to lose weight, not someone that's already in like average good shape and they don't really you know, have that issue or they're not on a diet. I'm talking about if you're really following a plan, a diet, and you want to lose weight, the best thing is to stay away from alcohol because what it does, you will then have one drink, you know, you'll have a second drink, and before you know it, the chemicals will start working in your brain and you won't be able to say no for the third and the fourth and the fifth drink. And this leads to number three of the reason, which is quite a big one for me. I, I think this is probably be, no, well, the first one is the biggest with just a lot of calories, but this one just adds to it, all right? This adds to it. Number three is the fact that you can't control yourself when you are intoxicated, because that's what alcohol is that's what we do we drink alcohol to get intoxicated a little bit you know feel that buzz you know have a really nice evening so when you do that when you have the alcohol you're obviously loading your system with with the, all these chemicals and you are getting a little bit intoxicated and feeling a bit buzzy um, and it also then increases your appetite that's what alcohol does that's why people have a glass of wine before dinner you know it just increases that appetite it makes the food taste better but obviously we take it to the next level when we go out and we party. So if you do that, 
you obviously won't be able to sustain that craving because now you're intoxicated. So you just won't be able to say no to bad food and you always tend to go to the quick and easy, you know, burger, pizza, anything that you can get your hand on, any dirty food, that oily, dirty food, that is what you are craving when you are intoxicated. So that just adds to more and more calories. Now, if you do that every single weekend, you know, it's, it's not going to help you with weight loss. In fact, it will probably make you gain weight. And that is why people gain weight, because they, they try to be kind of healthy during the week. But then on weekends, they just mess it all up by just drinking and eating whatever they want and in large quantities, like way too much. And they think that because they're just drinking it, you know, it's not bad food. It's, you know, it's okay. But it has so much sugar, calories, and the effect of it. Like I said, that's the effect. Let's say, let's use an example, right? You had a party, everything's chill, just a little bright, and someone, you're like super sober, and someone offers you a pizza, but you're on diet, and they say like, hey, would you like pizza or would you like salad? And you maybe say, you know what, I'm actually on a diet, I really try to be disciplined, so I'll, I'll rather have the salad with the chicken, you know, clean, grilled chicken, whatever, I'll, that's, I won't have the pizza, thank you very much. That's how you will respond, right? But if you have alcohol, three, four, five glasses in, you will... Again, like I said, have that little buzz. You'll start getting the cravings for food. And someone, that same person will come to you and say, hey, would you like pizza? Would you like this salad? And because you are not in 100% total control of your mind, because that's what alcohol does, um, you tend to say, ah, you know what? I've already had a few drinks. Let me just have a pizza. I'll work it off tomorrow. That's what happens. It plays with your mind. So it's not only just the fact that it has calories, like a lot of calories, but the fact that it also makes you think differently. It makes you, it basically makes choices for you without you noticing. And it's normally bad ones. And I'm not even talking about food necessarily. There are other things that alcohol make you do and uh, decide on. So um, my honest opinion, you know, the title of this video, do I believe you can lose weight with alcohol? I don't. I honestly don't think you can. Yes, it is possible if you have one or two drinks a week that is super low in calories and you literally just have one or two at a social event and that's it. And also if you eat clean. Because the thing is, if even you can not drink and still gain weight because you still have to monitor your diet. You still have to be clean. You can't just... You know, you can't blame every, everything on the alcohol. You still need to eat clean. But if you are eating clean and you have one or two drinks uh, on a weekend, that's fine. That is 100% fine. But it's, you know, moderation is the thing that that people struggle with. Because obviously after that first beer, um, you're feeling that buzz and you start making different decisions. And trust me, I know. I do it myself. But I feel like I'm more in control now because I don't necessarily need to lose any more weight. So for me, it's a decision where I say, you know what, I'm actually going to have a few beers tonight. I, I deserve that. I haven't had it in, say, two, three weeks. I'm going to enjoy my time with my mates and I'm going to like really go out and party and have fun and then work it all for the next month. You understand? But it's not a, it's not a weekly thing I know in South Africa. <laughs> and especially this, the, 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 the town that I come from, um, you know, it's, it's really tough because weekends are brides with mates. And it's drinking and it's every weekend. And that's how you obviously become social and you build your network. And I understand that. But uh, if you are on a plan to lose weight, I think it's best that you stay away from alcohol. All right. That's my opinion. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like that. If you, of course, think there is something else, if you want to mention anything, you can put the uh, question or statement down in the comments below. If you need any other help, you can contact me at www.rk400fitness.com where you can check out my website. It has everything there for you, a video that will explain it all. Uh, you can click on testimonials where you can see how many people I've helped and also you can click on about to check more about me. You can contact me directly at rk400fitness at gmail.com. We can have a little discussion ask around what you want, how can I help, those type of things. I can give you my number and we can chat on WhatsApp as well. Um, if you like this video, please smash that like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already yet. Uh, if you have 
thank you very much and i hope that you will enjoy the next videos that are coming there are quite a few others so you can watch them um, it's all about you know getting the knowledge and becoming more wise uh, in a sense of what to do around nutrition and you know fitness and like i said we all have our own opinions some people can lose weight and drink because they perhaps don't eat a lot and they exercise quite a lot and then they have beers or wine in moderation so it's not impossible it's not like if you have alcohol you will not lose weight it's all about moderation and just knowing what the goal is how much do you want to lose how what is the time period all those type of things all right but in my opinion no go all right have a lovely day i hope you enjoyed this video and we'll chat again see you soon